Welcome to Paul Spare Time. Today we've got a new video for you. We have mail time. And joining me is Hudson. And Brett. And hi there. Say hi, buddy. Hi. Hi. So you're used to watching us uh, do a coin roll search. Well, our banks have been closed. We haven't been able to get half dollars in two over months. two months. We may have some coming this Thursday, we're hoping. But in the meantime, we've been uh, participating online a little bit. So uh, this past couple weeks, we uh, bought some rolls on uh, Nub's channel. And Nub did his first live coin hunt donation box and uh we bought 20 rolls off of the nubs man for half dollars for half dollars and then we uh bought 20 rolls off the bass man bassman 64 and uh we also have won some coins that'd be baseman 64 and uh luckily for us both these packages came today so we're going to open them and I know in uh, Nub's coin hunt, it was his first time, so he was giving some special stuff away, and we got at least one very, very special coin. Yes. And uh, we didn't find any any uh, silver or anything fancy in the uh, rolls, but in uh, in uh, Baseman 64's uh, live hunt, oh my gosh, did we get lucky. There were some gorgeous looking coins. We cannot wait. To get our hands on them, which is precisely why we will open Nub's package first. Okay, so we're gonna open Nub's package here first. Trying not to cut anything important. Now, Hudson, we're kind of thinking we won 10 coins, but we don't remember exactly. Let's see what we've got in here. Oh, uh, calls are harder than they look. What oh my do gosh. we have? Anything else? Nope. All right. I know you guys want to see this. time. That's us. Yep. Got. What do we have here? Well, what do we have? So this is one of my favorites. It's the 1971S proof that Nubs found. Yes. That, oh, that's right. We did find one coin in the box. He found us a proof. Thanks, Nubs. Thanks. That's cool looking. All right. And then here is my very favorite one. It is a full silver buffalo silver round. Point nine 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 fine. Uh huh. Whoa! And Nubs was giving those away because it was his first ever live hunt. Of half dollars. Of half dollars uh, with for people. And you got to choose a uh, silver round. And Hudson and I love the buffalo nickel, so we chose this one. That is awesome. So we got the Indian on the front. Doesn't look, it looks kind of shiny, like, like shiny silver from the edge. And there's the buffalo in all its glory on the back. And the Indian. Mm -hmm. Wonder whose book that's gonna go in. Mm -hmm. I don't know. And then I'm pulling out my one of my other favorite thing that I would love in my book. A nineteen oh eight D Barber half a dollar. Whoa. That is a ninety percent half dollar. We do not have one. That coin is 120 years old. Mm -hmm. And it completes our set. Oh, we've got one of each barber now. Cool. All right, what's next? Okay. Next, we have a 1943. Mark, so I guess Philadelphia minted Walker. Ooh, cool. Walkers are the hardest thing to find other than a barber, which you like never find. Really we got a walker. Uh-huh. I really want a walker. 
There's what do we a, got here? It's a pretty nice 1969 D 40%er. Ooh, 40% Kennedy. I think we got that off, off of Mark Roll. Oh, yeah, we did get really lucky on that because I think we found four Mark Rolls and won prizes for all those. Wow, the next one I pulled up is pretty cool. It's a 1935 G Walking Liberty. So that's two Walking Liberties. So far. Whoa. The next one is a 1940. Another Walking Liberty? Yep. Whoa. Plane, so I guess it's a Philadelphia. Beautiful. Beautiful Walking Liberty. The next, which is another thing that I love in my book, is a 1960, almost uncirculated, Silver Washington quarter? Washington quarter, and I guess it's a Philadelphia because it's no mint one. So that is a 90% silver quarter. And it's uncirculated, I think. Wow, it's beautiful. We've got a 1950 D. Another silver quarter. 90%. Whoa. This is silver palooza. A 1952 D, silver quarter. Whoa. You've got a 1967. Uh, plain, so I guess Philadelphia minted. Yeah, we like it. Kennedy, 40%. You've got a 1967. Plain, so I guess it's Philadelphia. Kennedy half dollar. And you got a 1966. Plain, Philadelphia half dollar. And that looks like it's all for the nubs. So. All right, well, let's do a recap. Okay. So to recap our package from nubs, what we won from the live stream, we have a .99 fine silver round. That is a uh, Indian on one side, and the buffalo on the other. And we've got three Walking Liberties, and Hudson, the dates are? 1943, 1940, and in 1935. Sweet. Then we've got a Barber Half Dollar. A 1908 Barber Half Dollar, 90% silver. All of those, 90% silver. Then we've got three silver quarters. What are the dates, Hud? 1960, 1952, and 1950. Wow. And then we've got four 40% silver half dollars. And those dates are? 1969. 1967, 1966, and a 1967. And our last coin is the one that was found in the rolls, a 1971 S proof from Nubs. Cool Nubs, man, thanks so much. What a great package. All right, let's get it all dumped out here on the table. First. And one of my favorites from Base Man is a 2013 ASE American Silver Eagle. It was so awesome. Base Man, at the end of his stream, was doing an industry giveaway of a one ASE. And he said, No, I think that's not good enough. We're going to do a real industry giveaway. So instead of just one ASE, He gave away two ASEs. What's the year of the second one? 2011. Two ASEs. And he drew our name. How awesome. Next for the base man is a Merc Dime. What year is that, Hud? A 1941. Wow. 
Next is a painted half dollar. Is it painted or a sticker? It's stickered. Stickered. Maryland, the old line state, 2000. Pretty cool, in all honesty. After that, we got a... Nice 1996D that he found for us. I found a 96D that was like new that he included in our package. And then next is... A 1946S. Roosevelt Dime, uncirculated, 90% silver. Wow. The next is a 1941. Uncirculated mercury dime. Next we have four 40 percenters. A 1966, a 1967, a 1968, the D? Yep. And a 1968D, four 40 percenters from the baseman. All right, more from the baseman. Hudson, what do we have? A 1962 Benji that we got from a bag pool. A 1969 P Kennedy half dollar. A 1941 Mercury dime. A 1943. Warnacle. What is that? It is a 2002 S proof Nipsey and silver. Look at the bling from the edge. The edge blings. And it is 90% silver. I have never. Seen a coin that beautiful before. And he found that in one of our boxes in the rolls. Wow. That is unbelievable. More from the base, man. HUD, what do we have? A 1918 Walker. Oh my gosh. Walking Liberty. All right, what's next? A 1937 Walker. Oh, wow, and a 1934 Walker, whoa, oh, what, what's that shiny thing, where did it go, it's a 2002 S, another proof, uh -huh. and it's an FC, but it's the, just copper, that one is clad, so that one is not silver, but boy, is it blingy. Look at that, and that also was found in the rolls. Wow, Bassman. I mean, wow, Bassman. All right, Hud, what do we have now from the Bassman? A 1944 Walker. Another Walker? And... Oh, my gosh. And what else? A 1941 Walker. Oh my gosh. Another 1941 walker. And those are nice walkers. Yes, they are. And? A 1944 walker. Oh my. Four more walkers for the base man. Our next to last packet from the uh, base man. We have, what Hudson? A 1968 Kennedy, almost uncirculated. 40%. A 1967, looks uncirculated Kennedy. That one's pretty. Nice. And a, not another walker. A 1937 walking Liberty. Oh my gosh. Beautiful walkers. Our, HUD, our last packet that was in the envelope from the base man. And this is two coins that were in the rolls we found. Oh, what do we have here? A 2002 S Proof Nipsey Cloud. Community half dollar. Whoa. It's blingy too. It's clad. It's got the copper on the inside. 
not totally silver like that one but what a beautiful coin what a proof and then last, and our last coin but not least oh put my eyes out what is it a 2005 s proof nipsey silver oh my gosh 90 percent silver proof have you ever seen an edge that blings like that other than the one we found a while ago 2005 beautiful proof 90 percent proof why would anyone cash this in at a bank but thank you for cashing it in at a bank oh man we'll be back with the recap in a minute wow it's more beautiful in person than it was watching it live when we won we've got how many coins are there hudson 33 33 out of this and then we've got uh we've got ases we got proof silver proofs we got mercury dimes we got war nickels. We got painted and sticker coins. We've got eight walking liberties. Oh, and a Benjamin Franklin. And throw in an uncirculated Rosie and an uncirculated Merc dime. Two, four, six, seven 40 percenters. Oh my goodness. Now let's put them both together and see what we have. Look at this. We got two ASCs. We got a Buffalo Silver Round. We got four proofs, two of which are 90% silver. We've got 11 Walking Liberties, a Barber Half Dollar, a Benji Half Dollar, a 11 40% Half Dollars, three 90% Quarters, a War Nickel, Two Merc Dimes, then an uncirculated Merc Dime, then an uncirculated Rosie, and then a painted Maryland coin. 42 coins to put in our books. How in the world do we ever divide these up? Mm. Who's getting these in their book? I guess I'll probably take them off. <laughs> okay, probably not. All right. Hey, this has been an awful lot of fun. Our thanks to Baseman64. Our thanks to Nubs Hunt's Treasure. And this has been a ball. Please join us again when Paul has more spare time.